Make haste, O God, to deliver me. O Lord, make haste to help me. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and will be forever. Sustain me according to your promise, that I may live. I hate those who have a divided heart, but your law do I love. You are my refuge and shield. My hope is in your word. Away from me, you wicked. I will keep the commandments of my God. Sustain me according to your promise that I may live and let me not be disappointed in my hope. Hold me up and I shall be safe and my delight shall ever be in your statutes. You spurn all who stray from your statutes. Their deceitfulness is in vain. In your sight, all the wicked of the earth are but dross. Therefore, I love your decrees. My flesh trembles with dread of you. I am afraid of your judgments. Sustain me according to your promise that I may live. God, our refuge and our shield, Help us, and we shall be saved. For if you leave us, we are doomed. Remain with us always, so that the fullness of life may be ours, in Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Lord God, so rule and govern our hearts and minds by your Holy Spirit, that, always keeping in mind the end of all things and the day of judgment, we may be stirred up to holiness of life here and may live with you forever in the world to come through your Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. O God, creation's secret force, yourself unmoved all motion source, who from the morn till evening's ray, through all its changes guide the day. Grant us, when this short life is past, the glorious evening that shall last, that by a holy death attained, eternal glory may be gained. O Father, this we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son, who with the Holy Ghost in you shall live and reign all ages through. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal. Have mercy on us. Holy God, holy and mighty, holy and immortal. Have mercy on us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Let your loving kindness, O Lord, be upon us. As we have put our trust in you. Remember your congregation, O God. Which you purchased and redeemed long ago. Teach us, O Lord, the way of your statutes. Lead us in the path of your commandments. Let your ways be known upon earth. Your saving health among all nations. Rule your people righteously. And the poor with justice. Pour out, O Lord, your spirit upon all the people of the earth. That they may dwell in unity, peace, and concord. Restore us, O God of hosts. Show us the light of your countenance, and we shall be saved. Lord God, mercifully receive the prayers of your people. Help us to see and understand the things we ought to do, and give us grace and power to do them. Through your Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Loving God, in holy baptism you have gathered us together across all human divisions and have reconciled us to yourself in one body through the cross. Strengthen us now by your presence, 
that our thoughts and actions may be rooted and grounded in your love for us. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Gracious Jesus, our Lord and our God, at this hour you bore our sins in your own body on the tree, so that we, being dead to sin, might live unto righteousness. Have mercy upon us now and at the hour of our death, and grant to us, your servants, with all others who devoutly remember your blessed passion, a holy and peaceful life in this world, and, through your grace, eternal glory in the life to come, where, with the Father and the Holy Spirit, you live and reign, God, forever. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless us, defend us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen.